Greetings. We're going to take a look at a movie depicting Christopher Columbus' first encounter with the natives. Now, the natives always in movies like Tarzan and all of the movies, their dress code always was in, they would show nudity. So you would get the impression that they're savage and crazy, ignorant. But they've been living on the planet for thousands and thousands of centuries way before the, the, the white man, the Caucasian, came on the planet. Or every part of the planet. Let's get started. Now we don't know if they really look like this or not. We don't know. But his color complexion similar to mine. Not too that mine may be just maybe lighter than his. We don't know if his hair was like that. Not this is out of the fantasy of a Caucasian. But the point I want to make here is that now the United States this part North America and some parts of South America is full of Caucasians. The Caucasian had to leave his terrain because he didn't have nothing over there to grow with can hardly grow nothing over there you know the soil was being depleted the weather was lousy for growing they had diseases plagues I'm on, I'm on. Now, these people walk around, you know, half nude, little G strings on. Today, in the strip joint, they get drunk just to see women take it all off and show all of themselves and pay big money. 
this is how the Caucasian thinks. He see a little skin, he go crazy. Because his sex thing ain't together. So, we were used to, the black man all over the planet was used to nudity, have nudity. There wasn't no thing to him. We didn't start getting crazy until we came over here and started mixing in with the Caucasian. You know, he, he was over there. He had sex problems. He had Jack the Ripper killing up women. Serial killers. We didn't have that in our culture. Not back then, but they was they was they had all kind of freaky, weird types of things jumping off back then. Caucasian. He brought all that, all this rated X, mad sex over here with him, along with syphilis, and, uh, all types of diseases. And he took it, now he's taking those diseases, putting them in a test tube, you know, and, uh, Using it as a weapon. He weaponized his own diseases. Believe it or not. Now. Uh, now. Alex Jones was telling uh, T.I. that uh, the Vikings was over here. That's not in the lessons. He said the Vikings came way before Christopher Columbus. That's not in the lessons. This sister here, Drusilla Dundee Houston, she don't, she don't, there's nowhere she states that the Vikings was over here mixing in with the, the brothers. See, the Moors was tangling with the with the Viking. The Moors was. Also, they got a book out that came before Columbus, talking about the black man came. Before. See, the black man was already over here. He was in every part of the earth it is. He left pyramids here. Uh, he left. Big statues of him being here. So Christopher Columbus came over here and started killing off a lot of tribes, a lot of nations. And uh, the people found out about it and they, that's why they tearing down the statues. But leave them statues alone, man. That ain't gonna do nothing if you're gonna if you're gonna mix in with them, leave them statues alone. You know, if you're not gonna mix in with them, separate, because they're not gonna be on the planet that long, much longer anyway. Black light.